There have been 11 billion people who have walked on the face of the earth, and yet there has never been even one person who's exactly like you. So that makes you special, original, a masterpiece, and extraordinary. But if you don't know that you are extraordinary, you will never be able to enjoy an extraordinary life. Ladies and gentlemen, this afternoon, I'm going to share with you six tips how you can live an extraordinary life and enjoy an extraordinary career. Of course, the first tip in anything is knowing your passion. What is your passion? What is that burning desire inside of you? Joel Austin, the pastor of America's largest church and best-selling author, says, passion is the thing that makes you come alive. What is that for you? Oprah Winfrey calls it, passion is the thing that makes you give the highest form of expression as a human being. What is that for you? The French call it raison d'être, to mean reason for living. What is that for you? So ladies and gentlemen, whether you call it the thing that makes you come alive or the thing that makes you give the highest form of expression or reason for living, you got to have your passion first and foremost. Best-selling author Brian Tracy said, if you want to find your passion, ask this question. And the answer to that question will help you find your passion. And the question is, if money was not an issue, and if you can do anything in the world, what would that be? So that answer you just gave is probably your passion. America's most respected family psychologist, Dr. James Dobson, said, one way to find your passion is to write your eulogy, what you want read at your funeral, and then live backwards. What is it, if you were to die today, that you will be most regretful of not doing? On your tombstone, there are going to be two dates, born on this day, died on this day, and there's going to be a hyphen. And what do you want that hyphen to be? That hyphen is going to contain everything that you want to do. I really believe the reason people don't know their passion or don't live their passion is because they're afraid of failure. Well, I have good news for you, ladies and gentlemen. You are going to fail in this world anyway, no matter what you do. So why not go for what you want? Someone said there are two important dates in your life. One is the day you were born, and one is the day you found out why. Find the reason why and go for it. Take a chance. 